Living in the Age of Airplanes is a visually stunning movie that will open this Friday in many IMAX movie theaters. It's a virtual travelogue of the entire world. This National Geographic film covers the globe. Producer-director Brian Terwilliger shot in 18 countries on all seven continents. He calls airports portals to the planet. Now, a lot of you may know Brian for his film on general aviation, One Six Right. Well, Living in the Age of Airplanes had a gala premiere at the Air and Space Museum this week, and it's narrated by another friend to general aviation. In the Age of Airplanes, we've become explorers once again. In a single century, aviation went from impossible to nearly perfected. In just a flicker of time, life on Earth changed forever. So Brian, congratulations on the new film. What was the inspiration for the film? Well, so after One Six Right, which is very much a pilot-oriented story about uh, passion for flying, romance of flying, and why pilots fly, this film wants to sort of invoke that same sort of emotion and passion in the passengers that fly, mm -hmm. everyone in the back of the plane, people that don't necessarily love aviation uh, and maybe don't have an interest necessarily in flying or being a pilot. Um, but it shows them aviation in a way they never thought about it before. It was really important if we're going to show how the airplanes change the world to go around the world and film it and, and shoot it in as many places to really show how the people and cultures and ideas uh, and, and places and products are all you know, converging mm -hmm. uh, all around the planet and how, how the world has moved forward in a way that was inconceivable 100 years ago and now has become completely ordinary. There's no other way to do what airplanes allow us to do. And you really think about it, of course, it's pretty obvious, but if you didn't fly, you probably wouldn't go to the places we fly. And if you didn't go, how different would your lives be? You can go into this one amazing room and, and, and you're walking distance to almost every, anywhere in the world. You just walk down that hallway, close your eyes, take a seat, and you'll end up on another continent. It seems ridiculous. And Tom, you were at the premiere. What did you think? I was, and it's a beautifully shot film. Brian does a wonderful job of of sort of showing for a general audience uh, the impact of aviation on all of our lives and all of society and all the things that we have in our lives and in our homes that uh, less than 100 years ago simply were not feasible uh, without access to airplanes and high-speed transportation the way airliners and, and whatnot can do. So it's very thought-provoking and certainly, certainly worthwhile. Everybody's going to get a chance to see this film because Living in the Age of Airplanes is playing now in the Air and Space Museum and we'll have a feature showing of the film in, at our Sal uh, Salinas, California fly-in and our June homecoming fly-in here in Frederick, Maryland. And you can RSVP for our fly-ins at aopa.org fly-in.